Hello everyone, today we will explore how to create Epic with many tasks and subtasks, but creating only one task. So the answer are templates with subtasks. To do so, I'm using issue templates agent for Jira. Let's start by creating a new Epic with subtask from a template. Here you can notice template field where you can find your pre-configured templates, which results in filling the fields. And now we have our parent issue. So let's create it. And let's see a real magic happening under the project. And now I created not only one issue, but many with tasks and subtasks. Here is our parent issue and those are child issues. Now let's create our own template. You can choose between a basic template, which is about only one level, simple structure with two levels and advanced structure with three levels. So then you have Epic, then task, story, bugs, whatever issue type with zero level in Jira and then subtask. Let's go with this advanced one. First, let's name template. Let's go something with quarterly summary. And now let's select projects and issue types. This panel works for multiple projects, so you can create it once and use it in many cases and with many teams. Let's go with design, add to the list, maybe human resources and also deployment, for example. You can also uh, set the pair as default to speed up even more the issue creation. And then when project and issue types are matched, template is automatically applied. And uh, you can do it for uh, one project and issue type pair. So in this case, we can set it in everyone. This app supports all the fields. So if you need more, like for example, reporter or some custom fields, you can simply add them here. For example, reporter, description we have here. And now let's go pre-filled these fields. So for example, quarterly summary, reporter, and some description. Let's go with the same one. Here you can assign template to the category. You created them by yourself. So for example, we can do reports and, and it's easier to navigate in a templates library. Okay, so this is our epic. And now let's go to the child templates. So it's time for our first child template. Here we have to click add template, template name, for example, gathering data. And now let's choose issue type from a project. Let's go with a task. Here you can once again add some other fields. Gather data from your team. And it's uh, super crucial to remember to save it as sub template. If you want to create sub task, because this is a task, now you have to expand the view and once again, add some template. In here, let's name it as ask everyone in your team for data, everyone. And uh, of course, as a third level, uh, the only um, issue type to choose is subtask. Let's copy it and once again, save it. So in this case, we've already created epic task and one sub template.
What is also really useful, those templates support variables. So if you want this task to be published with, for example, today data, just put in summary formula you always use in Jira. So for example, today. And it will work. The last thing you should know about in creating templates is this toggle. So if you disable it, this template won't show up in a template selector on the create issue view. So you can think about it as a draft. When it's enabled, your team and everyone involved in project can use the template when creating the task. Okay, so we are all set up and let's save the template. All the templates are stored in a template library. You can edit them here or delete. And if it goes to the permission, you can also grant access to create a template for other users. Choose app settings. And now find the issue template agent manage templates and just add users as you always do in Jira. And that's all. And we wish you a very happy templating.